Um, let me ask all you motherfuckers this. Did you ever think about where you're going to go if Slab City ever closed down? Because that's a real thing, too. So, you know. Like, respect the reason that we're here and that we're actually allowed to be here. You know? There's only two ways that we can legally get kicked out of Slab City. Uh, eminent domain, because if it goes into war, war, or wartime, because it's a bombing range right there, and if they need the space, they need the space. Um, and uh, the EPA, if they deem it unfit for people to live in, or unfit condition for, you know, animals to exist in, and children to exist in, they will shut it the fuck down. Okay. First rule of this chapter. Just don't camp at the fucking hot springs. Don't camp at the hot springs. I don't come to your mom's house. Sit down in the toilet in your mom's bathroom. And watch her take a bath. Well, I poop. Okay. Think of this is like a bathhouse. Don't bring your kids here. It's not a fucking swimming pool. Okay. And it's not a place for you to camp because it's where people bathe. And that's creeper type shit. If you camp at the hot springs, you're a fucking weirdo. Go home. That's number one. Number two, don't dial 911. We're supposed to handle our own fucking problems. We're supposed to be revolutionists, okay? Why are you calling the fucking cops? Any bitches pay fucking taxes? Not state taxes, not local taxes. I don't have to pay out the fucking uh, the, the police department or the fire department, which is the first first call responders, okay? Sorry. Seriously. Don't dial 911. Stop calling the fucking cops. Don't tell anybody. Call me. You want my number? You can call me. You got a problem? Call me. Give me a messenger. I'm sorry, your fucking problem. I'll wear a suit to uniform. I, you know what I mean. Okay. Okay. Rule five. Um. Real slabbers dig their own shithole. That's on the back, uh, back wall at the, um, at the range bathroom, the rental room. But yeah, real slabbers dig their own shithole. It's me both metaphorically and, uh, uh, figuratively and literally. Um, like, rule number six, you have to stay two consecutive summers, um, in Slab City, uh, before you could ever be deemed as a real slabber. Um, which, like, I totally agree with. I didn't at first, but, like, staying here two summers consecutively, like, nobody ever claimed that shit unless they've been here for two summers. Because, like, you ain't, you ain't seen shit. Because the second year is worse than the fucking first one. Um, uh, if you're a real slabber, like, we'll know. We'll all know. You can't fool anybody. Okay. Um, like, observe. Here's a... Wait, that was rule 6, rule 7, whatever. 7, 8. Fuck numbers. Rule uh, triangle. Ob observe the tire boundaries of camps. So there's, like, boundaries made with, like, tires on the sides of people's camps and shit. Like, respect your neighbors. Respect their boundaries. Please. Um, next one. Don't touch my fucking trash. Don't near my yard. Here, it was nice. So, yeah. Alright. I think this one actually, um, this includes, um, chapter two. Uh, the very rude awakening of, uh, Slab City Rules. Like, um, for your very own. Jesse you Bonza. And number nine, he's over there. He's in there. The very own Jesse Bonza. Alright. Till next time. Peace. The children woke up and they couldn't find them. They left before the sun came up that day. They just drove off and left it all behind them. Shadow.